shirt. Uh, <laughs> this was not fun. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are in Arizona for Decadence Arizona, and I am so, 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 so excited. <laughs> I can't believe the year has already flown by, and now we're back here at Decadence. Everything that's happened in this past year, like, I would not have imagined happening thinking back, and it's just, like, absolutely crazy. I'm really excited to be back in Arizona. I've been here for a week visiting with my family and stuff. Ryan flew in for Decadence on Friday, and now it's Sunday, and now it's rave day, and now we're going. I'm super excited. We're staying at my cousin's place, which is pretty nice. Nice. Thanks, Zach, for letting us stay with you guys. But yeah, ready to go. I kind of did like a sporty look for today. And I've never done winged eyeliner before. I like tried it out before, but this is what the look looks like. And then this top is from Rave with Me Hente. Glitter is from Gypsy Shrine. And then these joggers are just from Forever 21. And then I have my holographic dolls kill boots as always. It's gonna be cold. I remember telling people like, oh, it's not gonna be that cold. Like it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be really nice. Probably 70s during the day, like 50s at night, whatever. And when you're in a freeze advisory so we're bundling up i brought my porter long sleeve alongside just in case if and when i do get cold i think it'll be fine in the crowd and once you're inside stuff like the tent and whatever but when it's like when you're walking to your car or going to the bathroom or something like it might be cold it's kind of fine right now but i also feel like i'm just really excited and i just like, haven't calmed down this vlog will be different than normal i won't be taking this camera with me i did get a media pass but i am choosing to leave my camera at home and i hope you guys understand just because decadence is like something so so special to me being with all my friends and stuff like that so I'm trying not to record as much. I'm gonna film as much as I can on my phone, but I'm really gonna take this time just to enjoy it with my friends and enjoy it with everyone that's pro that I probably am gonna meet up with and all that stuff because I'll have the totem. So yeah, I hope you guys understand, but holy ship content is coming. So that is what we're leading up to here. Just gonna take a little break, but I'll still take you guys along with me. And yeah, for now, Ryan and I are gonna head to our friends pregame. Then we'll be on our merry way. <laughs> Hello. Are you excited? Are you ready for I'm your pretty, first uh, Arizona rave? I'm pretty stoked. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a fun time. Yeah. <laughs> 
Happy Chris Lake Day! Again! Well, it's Annie up day, but you guys, we're seeing Chris Lake. Right now it's raining, so that's not cool. I'm gonna go get my makeup done by this girl, Valeria. We met on Instagram. She's super cool. We've been wanting to meet up, and she's at Decadence this weekend. So she's doing my makeup for today, for day two, so I can look all nice and pretty in the new year. So I'm gonna go meet up with her, and I'll show you guys what she does so you guys can check her out and all that stuff. A little cross promotion here, and what has been your guys' favorite festival? My favorite? Yeah. My used to love Sunset Forest. Honestly? I love Sunset Forest. Actually, no, EDC Vegas. Yeah, that's EDC Vegas, Vegas and Forest. But Forest and Lost Lands. I went to Forest. Yeah, I went to Forest for the first time this year. Your <laughs> ASMR video, I was cracking up. Really? Okay. <laughs> I hate just like sitting in front of a camera I'm just talking for like so long. So yeah. I was like, how can I make this fun? I think I'm gonna do it with Coachella too and EDC. Like, I feel I like big festival lineups like that, it's funny to do it. How long have you been doing makeup for? Ooh, since I was like 15. Oh my god. Yeah. Awesome. I started doing YouTube videos, but then like I wasn't like consistent. God. And then on top of that, you do like hosting, right? Yeah. How did you get into that? Uh, they found me on Instagram. Oh, yeah. that's cool. And it's like a show in like Mexico. It's like it's like a relentless beat. Gotcha. Like in Mexico. Gotcha. It's like the biggest one. That's cool. Yeah, so they do all of Insomnia and Japan. What would you say is like the biggest difference between like Mexico festivals and like US festivals? The crowd. Really? Yeah, I feel like we're so far. A lot of stuff like yeah. music wise and just like on every. I mean, the bass community is like growing a lot, but it's not as crazy as here. Would you say like Mexico is more like the mainstream yeah. type Yeah, like yeah, T.S. Jones. Rex Kruplet. Oh yeah. We were like, we're stuck back by like one of the last speakers and we left. <laughs> oh, dude, no, we tried. Uh, it was what? way too packed. Literally, I've been running around like a mad woman. I went to go get Ryan lunch before we left and the place was closed, so great. We're doing well. I also had to stop at Walmart because I'm gonna attempt to wear this outfit even though it's really cold, but you know what? This makeup is so good, like I, I can't not. I'll show you guys the after look, hopefully, if I have time, but kind of running around like a mad woman right now. Very much shout out to Val. Like, I love my makeup, it looks so good. Like, look, you guys. Oh, this was not fun. I didn't have time to give an update, but so I'm doing it on my phone and it's raining. Hoping my makeup doesn't get messed up, but we're in the outfit. I'll put a photo of what it looks like because I didn't have time to do it. This is not fun. So I know I showed you guys the outfit, but didn't tell you anything about it. So it's a set from Dolls Kill that I got and I wore it with some tights I got from Walmart and then my holographic boots, which I ended up throwing out after I found a hole in them, but I'm gonna buy them again, RIP. Oh.